how social media can be used to our advantage. Did you know 71% of teens have established online profiles on social media? Sites such as Facebook and Twitter can be used in the classroom. You may have recently heard that Snapchat has recently launched an iPhone which made its co-founders $500 million per day. This is one of the reasons why educators are reluctant in incorporating social media in education. Social media can be used for student collaboration. Whether they are sharing pics or commenting posts, this is a social interaction purposes. Students use social media day in and day out to talk to their peers and teachers about class-related problems. You can engage in business. The ability to assess, analyze, retain, and share info is skyrocketing as they do not even know that developing the skills to use social media. Bond nodes and the future of Zimbabwe's industry. Now you may ask, what are bond nodes? Well, according to the RBZ, Reserve Bank of Zimbabwe, they are a domestic financial instrument introduced to guard against the externalization of the US dollar and they were introduced on the 4th of May 2016. Zimbabwe is running out of paper money for an array of reasons, not least because the country has a sustained trade deficit, importing more than... Patience. What more would you want from a person ex except for patience? If one has patience, I can talk to a person if they've got patience. I expect a friend who can support me. Well, look for people, most teens nowadays are used to uh, communicating, okay, they're used to socializing uh, through social media. Uh, patience, exactly, is that a virtue that they've got, um, that has been instilled in them, because they, they aren't used to dealing with people on a day-to-day -day basis. But then patience, if you've got patience, you take time to listen to a person. I can come to you, maybe I'm, I'm in need, I'm in trouble. I need someone to listen to me. I need attention. I need help. Patience. If you've got patience, you can heal wounds. If you've got patience, you can heal a troubled soul. If you've got patience, you can lift a burden from someone's heavy heart. Thank you. Just a few tips on today. When you are standing at a podium, if you're saying a speech, try not to use your words. Because the moment you start reading, I stop losing focus on what you're saying, and now I'm paying attention on, ah, so she didn't know what she was saying. She had to keep looking at her paper. Don't use your hand movements. Don't use too much gestures. Fine, it's good to emphasize a point by hand gestures, but don't continuously use your hands. Why? Because the moment I start looking at you, I deviate from listening to you and looking at what your hands are doing. Don't move around. Don't pace around too much. Why? Same thing, I start deviating from listening to what you're saying and I'm starting to look at, okay, what do her shoes look like? What is she wearing? And things like that. So sometimes it's good, don't be by the podium exactly, but just find a way that people are listening to what you're saying and they're not too busy looking at all the other things. So us as Global Foundation of Public Speaking, I think you had uh, highlighted we are Global Foundation of Public Speaking. We run a debate league across the country, so we have, um, uh, league running uh, in right now, it's actually running right now, and it has up to 12 schools within and outside that area. So, we are actually discussing and saying we really want you know, to be yeah, to be part of this. So, next day, uh, all those in lower six and uh, the juniors you're going to be enjoying because you're going to be under the junior category on number three, it's Vumba. The second position, no one. Tied on first position is Matopos and Inanga. Seniors, on the second position is Matopos with 326 points. And the overall winning house is Vumba with 322 points.